Yeah. Back up for one second. Just tell us your, your view, your opinion. Why are doctors and patients so afraid of hormones in the first place? Because I'll ask my patients. I'll be like, why are you so afraid? And they can't even tell me why they're afraid. They just are. Well, they're afraid because of breast cancer. Yes. And what are their main concerns? Breast cancer, breast cancer, breast cancer, breast cancer, breast cancer. Whether it's of someone who doesn't have breast cancer, they're afraid it's going to cause breast cancer. And someone who does have breast cancer, they think even local vaginal estrogen is going to cause it. And then certainly the breast cancer survivor who's looking for systemic hormone therapy, they think it's an absolute contraindication because everywhere they look, it's published as a absolute contraindication. But in medicine, there are no absolutes. There's risks and benefits. And you know, the oncologists are really good at discussing risks and benefits. They do it all the time. I sat there and they told me, here's the risk and benefits from doing this different chemotherapies, the different regimens, you know, the different endocrine um, adjuvant therapies, the surgeries, lumpectomy. So like, this is not a new concept of risk versus benefit. But for some reason, when it comes to women suffering from menopause or from sexual pain, that risk benefit conversation seems like it's not important. 